Damon James. Don't take chances with risky investments. Plan, invest, retire. McMurray stick in the right corner mob zone. Daniel Ray got to that, overscaled it. Hammered hard by Zach McNeil in behind the McMurray net, and that one hurt quite a bit. Crusaders Sasha, one of the opposing blue Malpe. He's going to try a diving poke check in on goal, and it goes in on Forte, who makes the save, and they're going to call the Barons for a penalty there. Malpe dove at a loose puck at the right side of the net, roughing. They're showing a replay of that play. Tom Chuck didn't even touch him. Wine, slap pass to Kruper, left half forward. Shoots, he hit the post! And it rolled, put it left corner. And it's fed mid blue line, put up, shoots through his screen. Save for Tam, rebounds, lying there, scores! No, it's waved off! The whistle went before the puck crossed over the goal line. Bossy up the right wing side. Get it out to center, Brzezinski's got it there. Hammered by Zach Wittenberg! Oh, what a huge shoulder hit! Wittenberg absolutely train-wrecked Cameron Brzezinski with a shoulder hit that knocked him flat on his back. He's heading to the box. They're going to call him for charging. But man, oh man, that is the hit of the season right there. Lofthouse who got it to neutral, slipping and falling at center ice. Was Brett Van Oss now a penalty as we got Kemp pushing and shoving with Chetlin Houcher. And they're going to drop the gloves, or at least Houcher was. Kemp trying to get a right hook in on Houcher. Came back with a big right of his own. Houcher another right as Kemp trying to get a right. He just hit the referee in the face. Kemp and Houcher still tied up, and the linesmen get between them. As Tanner Laderoot gets to this, holds on to it. Banks it left side as he got hit by Houcher, and Houcher and Laderoot are still pushing at each other, challenging each other to a fight. Now they're going to drop the gloves and really get into a fight, and Houcher got two big right hooks on, dodges the left hook, and he knocks Laderoot down to the ice! Puck in the right corner, Sherwood Park zone. Nice move, Zach McNeil. Cuts to the right circle. Fed it right point, Brent McNeil. Holds on, back skate, shoots one. Never got through, still loose. Backhander off the post from Isaac Che. Chopping at it, can't get a shot through. Clearance kept in right point, Brent McNeil. Fake the shot. Gave it left side, Drohan. Back to McNeil, mid blue line. Shoots through a screen. Off of both posts. No, he scores. <laughs> is livid. It'll come out to center ice there. As they're discussing this over at the booth. It was the long point shot by Brett McNeil. He went off the right Our poke. Cycles for Star. Got it back to Holmes. Right side of the net. Pokes it side of the cage. Jamming at it. Two saves by Klassen. And he sprawls on top of that one to get a whistle stopping play. As Holmes is caught in a headlock by Chris McKay. And that's going to be ruled legal as well. High slot drops it off to McKay, whose wrister goes out of a skate and wide right of the net. Barons get to it. As what a brutal hit from behind. Franz pokes it down to the left corner. Hammered from behind by Fanouk, but he braced himself well enough that he didn't draw a penalty because he, he overskates the puck, takes a slash. Franz cross checks Fanouk down from behind. He dives to the ice. Then McLeod going to try to jump Franz. Now we got a big old scrum down in the left corner of the Sherwood Park zone. Off the draw, Cooper cuts behind the net. Four on four here. Put it high slot. Bowden has a chance. He fires it wide of the net. Still loose side of the cage. Poked at and a sprawling Fortan kept that out. Puck, Tom Chuck double team down low, hit high and hard by Bossy as he was off balance. Then a right point shot his block, came to Van Oss, backhander off of Fortan, wide right of the net. In free to Lawler in the right wing corner. Lawler cuts up to the right half board, spun away from pressure, cuts top right circle, into the slot, turns and shoots, SCORE! There, the speed and evasion tactics of Luke Lawler pay off for the mob as he waltzes his way out into the high slot. Gets a turning wrister away that may have gone off of Adam Durkee in front. 
Either way, the Barons have extended their lead to two to nothing, and Lawler's line again continues to produce. Left wing sign for the carry in by Van Oss. Down to the left corner. Van Oss centered one ball. He's all alone, and his shot is tipped wide left to the net. Clearance yeah. by it's merely academic now. Turned over at neutral to Durkin. He shoots wide to the empty net from the center circle. And four seconds down to go. The Barons are going to sweep the weekend against Sherwood Park on Bizarro night at the Casman Center. And they skate away with another win. They're in a tie for second place. Yeah.